Good afternoon. Welcome to Jim Mummy's World of Weather. Clicked on to long range weather forecast discussion for December 13th to the 25th. Uh, yesterday there was problems with the website, but it's I couldn't be I wasn't able to update anything. So I updated it early this morning and then I'll be updated again later today. Um, first we're looking at the period for December 13th to the 17th. The pattern remains unchanged. We have these large positive height anomalies over Alaska, the Bering Sea, the Aleutians. And we have these strong areas of um, negative height anomalies across Canada, West Central Canada, and across the lower uh, latitudes here with a fast cyclonic flow. And we have a ridge here or above normal heights across the southern U.S. The west will remain unsettled, but the best chance of the precipitation will be across the north central uh, California into the central Rockies. An Arctic boundary across the north central Rockies will be another area of precipitation. And temperatures across the area will be more than 20 degrees below normal. The northern plains will also experience anomalies near 30 degrees below normal. Anomalies will be less extreme further east. The Great Lakes will still experience lake effect snows. Parts of the southeast and the east central states may see a snow and or ice threat as moisture overruns a cold air in place. That'll be later next week. Uh, now for the period for December 16th to the 20th. Here we are at the 16th, little change is expected, is expected in the flow. We still have these area large positive height anomalies uh, that remain in place. This is a blocking ridge that's keeping the pattern in place with uh, below normal heights across the northern U.S. and we have above normal heights across the southern U.S. and with the fast westerly flow across much of the nation. So you're looking at the GFS and then I go through each day and I'm going to the 20th and you can see that this area of above normal heights here and then we look at the rest of the models, you see they generally forecast the same thing. So during this forecast period, I am forecasting above normal temperatures here and here, and here I'm forecasting anomalies to be about three to 12 degrees above normal and below normal temperatures here, a forecast with, a temp, uh, with anomalies at 10 to 20 degrees above normal, uh, below normal, I'm sorry. And for precipitation, above normal precipitations here and for this region too. Now we're going to look at the period for December 21st to the 25th. There's a little uncertainty here in the pattern. Um, we're going to look here at the 21st. We start seeing some kind of a change here. We have this large ridge across um, the Gulf of Mexico of the Caribbean. Below normal heights here. Positive height anomalies off the west coast, and now we have negative anomalies where we have strong positive anomalies. I don't know if it's going to be uh, that quick in getting rid of the, the strong positive height, height anomalies here across um, Alaska, but then we go through each day and we go to the 24th and we see um, pretty much the same pattern. Then we look at the GFS ensembles. Still has below normal heights, fast zonal flow. The ridge at above normal heights builds north. But you can see here that it's sliding west, eastward. This area of positive height now are sliding eastward. So then we look at the rest. This is the European. They're all showing the same thing. But um, I want to show you this. We're looking at the NAEFS, and it kind of keeps the above normal heights here below normal heights across this region, uh, below normal temperatures, you say, um, further west and near normal temperatures across this area. And then we have the CFS uh, weeklies has below normal heights in the west, above normal heights here, still a fast westerly flow. So I think this, the temperature forecast is based primarily on the ensemble means. And that'll be above normal heights here, above normal temperatures here with anomalies at two to eight degrees and below normal temperatures here. I'm not that confident with this forecast this far out. So uh, below normal temperatures here with anomalies will be near a few degrees of 10 degrees below normal for precipitation, calling for 
below normal precipitation for the Southern Rockies, above normal precipitation here. So that is a long range weather forecast discussion for December 13th to 25th. Thanks for coming to Jim Mung's World of Weather and have a good day.